Hey guys, we have here our Canon PIXMA TR7000 all-in-one printer. And in this video, we want to explain to you how to first connect this printer to your wireless network. And then also how we're going to connect our Mac computer or Apple Mac computer to this printer so we can use it to print and also to scan. Now, in case you want to connect to your printer from a Windows computer, then I suggest you check out my other video here in the upper right corner. Okay, so at first we're going to press the OK button to get into the settings menu. And here the second line item is LAN settings. So we're going to press the down button once and then we're pressing OK. Now in this screen we can see that we have two different options for Wi-Fi. One is the Wi-Fi network and the other one is a wireless direct connection. So wireless direct means you're directly connecting from your smartphone to the printer or from your computer to a printer. But that's not what we want to do. We want to connect here to the wireless network. And that means we're going to select the first option. Now in the following screen, we're going to see a couple of advanced options, which we don't really need. We're just going to select here Wi-Fi setup and then manual connect. So now the printer is going to search for all the wireless uh, networks in the area and we're going to see a list of all the networks really soon so here we can now select our uh, our own wi-fi network so in this case here in our case this is safety first and of course here we have to now enter a password which is a little bit tricky and it takes some uh, getting used to but in the end once you understand how it works it's really simple so first you can use the up and down arrows to select the specific character that you want to enter. Now at the moment we're only entering lowercase characters and in order to change it to uppercase characters we press here the button with the two chain links on the left side. See now we have switched to uppercase characters and if we press the button one more time we're changing to numbers and if we press it one more time then we're going to uh, be able to select um, special characters of course these uh, the selection here revolves so if you press then one more time we're going to back to lowercase characters and so on and in this way we can enter our uh, password to our wireless network now in case you notice that you made a mistake then you can always erase the last entered character by pressing the stop button and once we have completed entering our uh, password then you press start in order to try to connect to the network now most of the time this process will just work and it's going to successfully connect but there is a chance that your router will not accept the connection to your printer and in that case we're going to show you an alternative way of how to establish the connection so first we're going to go back in the menus a couple of times until we see here on the bottom other connection types so we're going to select this and then here we're also going to select manual connect and now the uh, printer is going to again search for the wireless networks again we're selecting our network and here we're going to select now wpa slash wpa2 and here we're going to do the same thing we are going to enter our network password and within a couple of seconds, we should be able to successfully connect to our wireless router. And at this point, we're all set here on the printer. We can just also check here that we are successfully right now connected to our Wi-Fi. And we're backing out to the main menu. And so now let us continue on our computer. And so now here on our Mac, we're going to click on the Apple logo and then system settings and we're going to scroll down all the way until the bottom where we see the uh, printers so that's the last item here printers and scanners we're going to select on this and in theory the uh, Apple should have already identified our uh, Canon Pixma printer in the uh, in the network and it should already be available to use so in case that's not happening for you, then we can manually add the printer now. So we're going to first go through the same steps. We're going to go through the system settings, scroll down all the way to the bottom. Again here, printers and scanners. And then here we're going to say add printer. And then here the uh, 
Mac is going to search for uh, printers in our network environment and it has the found the uh, Canon TR7000 already. We're going to select this, select add, and then how here it is available. So now it's ready to use so we can uh, print our documents, but we can also uh, from here use the scanner option. So if we say open scanner and we have currently inserted here the quick start guide from the uh, from this printer. We have put that on the scanner. So we're still going to do a, a fast scan here. And we can see here the preview where we can select the printing of the area that we want to scan. So this is kind of wrong. So let me adjust this. And then we're going to say scan. And this is going to take a couple of seconds. So I'm speeding this up by quite a bit. Uh, so now within a couple of seconds, we are going to have our scanned image here in the pictures folder on our hard drive. And so that's already it. Our uh, Canon PIXMA is ready to be used. I hope you found this video helpful. If you have any more questions or comments, then please leave a message below.